What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading. Cups are side to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. Uh, free general collective reading. Okay, so I received a channel. Um, I wasn't expecting it, but I did, so I'm going to share it, just like everybody else does. So, I'm here. Um, it's a free general collective reading, so only take the messages that resonate with the rest. It's a very interesting one. It's very interesting. Um, it's very interesting. And after I share it, I'll tell you my thoughts on it. So, okay. So, the channel message I received was, um, several air signs have been spying on you, in particular, some lawyers and a psychiatrist, is what I heard. However, um, I, however, it's about to backfire is what I heard. Um, the psychiatrist wants to prescribe you psychedelics. They are convinced you are majorly depressed. Many shocking series of chain events are about to occur. That's what I heard. But you are most certainly not depressed. You are very opposite. Okay, I heard, but you are most certainly not depressed. You're actually opposite. So you plug it in how it resonates. What the crap, man? So you plug it in how it resonates. Okay, so you've got several air signs spying on you, apparently. Um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. Um, in particular, some lawyers and a psychiatrist. So you've got several air signs spying on you. Now, spying on you. However the hell they're spying on you. Um... It sounds like they need some, uh, they need mental health treatment is what it sounds like there. And I'm serious. It sounds like they need some freaking mental health treatment if they're spying on you and they don't even have the balls to tell you they're spying on you. And I'm serious about that. I just want to throw that out there. Um, if they don't even have the big kahunas to tell you they're spying on you, I mean, wh why the hell are they spying on you? Just saying, just saying. Um, just saying. You know what I'm saying? Hmm. Makes one wonder. Things that make you go, hmm, you know what I'm saying? So several lawyers and a psychiatrist. But I heard the psychiatrist is just, they're convinced. Oh my God, they're just convinced you're majorly depressed. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. What the crap, man? But I heard um, it's actually very opposite. It's very opposite and you're not. I just do that dramatics because the channel message is redonkulous. It's freaking redonkulous. These are high level supposed to be high level in their community, I'm presuming, and in society, but they are spying on you and convinced you're majorly depressed, but I heard you're not. I heard you're not. You're actually very opposite. What it sounds like to me is they just want to screw you. And I'm serious. They, they're convinced you're majorly depressed because they want to believe you're majorly depressed. And I'm serious. I heard it's so bad that the psychiatrist wants to prescribe you psychedelics. Is what I heard. So I looked it up when I got the channel message before I put the camera on about prescri usage of pres um, prescribing psycho um, psychotics, basically. Um, uh, psychotics, apparently, psychiatrists do prescri prescribe psych uh, psychotics. So um, psychobillion and ecstasy, apparently. Um, just a little informational session here. Um, because I wanted, there was a couple things I wanted to say about the channel message. The first thing is, it's not, okay, they're convinced you're majorly depressed, they're spying on you, but it's not there. If you feel like you need mental health treatment, go get mental health treatment. But if I heard you're not depressed, you're actually like, it sounds like you're happy in life. Um, so they can spy on you till the cows come home, but they can't force you to go into the damn office and, um, get mental health treatment if you're not fucking majorly depressed and I'm just serious or depressed or what have you. If you don't want the medicine, you guys, you don't want the treatment, there's a thing called right to refuse. I just want to throw this out here right now from a nurse's perspective because I don't believe in uh, this channel message. I don't believe in it. If somebody need as a nurse, I'm telling you, I don't believe in it because why the hell are they spying on you? One, high levels of society and high levels of community and two they want to they automatically have you already diagnosed in their fucking head 
But whoever you are, you haven't, um, I'm assuming you have not went and sought mental health treatment from this psychiatrist. I'm assuming you have not. Um, most certainly have not. Most certainly have not is what I just heard. So you haven't. You haven't sought mental health treatment from the psychiatrist. So you don't want their services. Okay, so you don't want their services. So, right to refuse, you guys. Right to freaking refuse, okay? And they're expensive anyways. Psychiatrists are fucking expensive. So, they automatically have you diagnosed in their damn head and they're spying on you. It sounds like they need to go, uh, the psychiatrist needs to fucking visit a psychiatrist is what it sounds like. And I'm serious about that. There's something really screwed up about that situation. There just really fucking is. I'm serious. I mean, I don't know what else to say about that. Because it upsets me that these people obviously are behind the scenes. And they, I mean, what the hell is wrong with them? And I'm serious about that. They need to evaluate their own mental health and their own selves before they go off trying to attack other people. And I'm serious about that. I'm freaking serious. By the way, these are psychic intuitive messages. Um, I'm trying to um, make that very abundantly clear on all my uh, all my all my videos. I haven't been the best about it, but they're psychic intuitive messages, just so you know. But yeah, it pisses me off. Do things the fucking right way. If there's a patient that wants to come into your facility for mental health treatment, then fucking treat them. I guess I'm speaking to you, stalkery psychiatrist. And stalkery lawyers, I guess. Because I heard lawyers, plural lawyers, and psychiatrists. So at least two lawyers in the universe and a psychiatrist. And a psychi the psychiatrist apparently already has your fucking diagnosed. So uh, I read up on it a little bit. The psycho, um, the ecstasy and the um, psilocybin, however you say that, psilocybin. Uh, it's used to treat, um, depression and post-traumatic stress disorder. Whoever you are, I heard you're very happy. So I'm assuming you probably don't have diagnoses of depression or, um, post-traumatic stress disorder, but they want to give them to you. They want to give you these diagnoses. They already have them fucking diagnosed in their damn head. They just want to get you in the damn facility to plop you with the fucking diagnoses. Well, you guys, you have the right to refuse. And if they did give you a mental health uh, assessment, then okay. I, I Listen, I want to tell you guys, I had to have a mental health assessment through CPS. I had CPS called on me six times last year. Six times. Six. And I have all my not indicated letters. Six times. One of them, I had to have, undergo a mental health, um, mental health assessment through CPS. Child Protective Services. Um, true story. But I still have it. I still have it to this day. And if I ever had to undergo another one, I absolutely would. No problems. Do you hear voices? No. Do you see things not in the normal 3D? No. Are you depressed? No. Do you have post-traumatic stress disorder? No. Do you have feelings of anxiety? No. Period. I mean, what can they say? They have to take your word for it. So what I'm saying is somebody's trying to pin you guys, at least one of you guys in the universe. They're trying to pin you. They already have this damn grand plan. The fucking psychiatrist, the person high standard of the fucking community, and some lawyers already trying to pin your ass. So you use your personal power. And if you have to undergo a mental health assessment, then, then do it. But like I said, are you depressed? No. Do you have feelings of anxiety? No. Um, do you want to hurt yourself? No. Do you want to hurt anybody else? No. I mean, are you interested in medication? No. You know what I'm saying? I mean, this is crazy. It's freaking crazy. These people need mental health treatment is what they need. And I'm serious about that. I'm serious. A fire sign is getting a huge wake up call and an air sign. And an earth sign. Okay, I heard a fire sign, an air sign, and earth signs getting a huge wake-up call. You plug in how it resonates. Everybody but water. Aries, Leo, Sage, um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Well, that's what you get for trying to screw people behind the freaking scenes, you guys. 
And then hope a psychic don't pick up on the channel messages. And I'm serious about that. What the hell? Whoever the hell, I mean, it, I don't think it's for you. Whoever I'm, these messages are for, it's you're trying to get, they're trying to screw you behind the scenes. But I feel the psychiatrist and maybe the lawyers watch my videos because the hell, we're almost to freaking, uh, we're almost to 11.6. We're very shy away from 11.6, like three people away from 11,600 subscribers. Anybody could freaking watch this channel. Anybody can. But we've got almost 11,600 people on this channel. And that's just the truth. So it could, I feel the psychiatrist, the weird, freaky psychiatrist and some lawyers view my uh, channel and the person they're trying to screw. But I'm telling you this person, you're, they're trying to screw to help you because I've been there. I've been there. I had Child Protective Services called on me six times in a year, you guys. Six times I had to undergo a mental health assessment with them. I passed. But, you know, I mean, some people don't have education to in the know-how to undergo those kind of things if you do not want to basically be screwed over by the system. So I'm trying to help you is what I'm trying to say. I'm trying to help you. So if you get called in for a mental health assessment, I feel you might, whoever this is for. I feel you're probably going to get called in for a mental health assessment, okay? So if you do, and I mean, some you might already have diagnoses. See, like, I don't have any mental health diagnoses. I don't have any medical diagnoses. I don't take any prescribed medicines for me personally, for me personally. Now, everybody's situation's different, and I'm not telling you to lie. Um, if you truly are wanting to harm yourself or somebody else, I'm not telling you to lie. But no, if you want to harm yourself or somebody else, please be honest. I'm not telling you to lie, period. I'm not telling you what to do. Everybody's got free will. I'm not telling you what to do at all, at all, at all, at all, okay, at all, but I am, I will tell you what I would do, okay, it's, it's not my place to judge, it's not my place to tell you what to do, it's my job on here to deliver the psychic intuitive messages, and that's what I got tonight, okay, so I will tell you what I would do, I've done it before, I'll do it again if I have to, you know what I'm saying, but, um, if it was me, and it might be a psychic I'm speaking to, possibly. It might be. And there's a lot of you guys out there now. There's, I mean, YouTube is popping with um, psychics now. Psych I mean, psychic, psychic, psychics. I mean, when I started this two years ago, the face of YouTube uh, spiritual community has changed tremendously. Well, now we've got psychic investigators, i.e. I'm one of them. Um, that didn't even exist two years ago. Um, I, I was a, one of the help bring it to the forefront. I mean, I'm not saying I brought it to the forefront. There were several of us that did, but what I'm saying is that that did not exist until several of us started doing that, um, is what I'm saying. And I feel very proud to do, uh, proud to do that. Absolutely. But I feel a psychic is about to be attacked is what I'm trying to say. And I didn't hear a psychic was going to be attacked, but you've got a psychiatrist and you've got at least two lawyers out there trying to pin your ass on something. And I'm serious. I feel you might get called for a mental health assessment, and I'm serious about that. So, if you do, and you truly don't have anything going on with you, like you're cool, like you don't have any mental health diagnoses, you don't have, um, you don't want to take the medication, blase, 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 then you need to be very calm going in there. Be very, very, very calm, okay? Answer their questions in a very calm manner. Okay, just like this, a very calm manner. And then, um, especially.